my vlogging camera needs like a Snapchat filter. I'm heading to my Toyota shoot. So this is actually a pretty big deal because this is a national commercial. So if you have cable, which I don't, so I'll probably never see this commercial, but you may see me every day. What we're shooting today is Toyota's new hydrogen car. But today is a big day. I haven't had um, a national commercial since Dos Equis, So that's been two years now. So I'm pretty excited, pretty nervous too, because I am I am kind of exhausted. So I hope I do a good job. All right, we're currently on set. I am on my iPhone. It is a closed set, so I can't really show anything. But this is some BTS of one of the shots. And lock it up and roll, please. Rolling. All right, here we go. Ready and action. And cut. Give me a blessing. Very good. We don't know better. I ain't the only nigga, so there ain't no pressure. Just come and get it. I know you ready, it's automatic Give it to me, no time to play Won't hesitate when I'm diving in Swimming so deep in your water Vision blurry, vision blurry We're going on to people Drowning for the weekend I don't need a reason Put it all on this I like some 43 on one shit. All my niggas wanna do is pop stop. And I'm to a birthday and to a lifestyle. What happened last night is that Brian and I were invited to the Bay concert with, um, and they are touring with Division, who we absolutely love and party next door. So um, we decided to go to that even though I had a very busy day, but we actually had some extra tickets given to us. So I decided to do a um, Instagram giveaway for some of my LA people. And I got to meet the winner of that last night. Her name is Marilyn and she was so, so, so sweet and so grateful. All of my followers, all of you guys have the same energy and the same positivity and the same drive as her. And I know I haven't met all of you, but I can sense that just by your comments and your support. And I'm just really, really grateful to have um, the support that I do from you guys. This is what I'm looking like now. I need to put my hair down and then I'm going to put my dress on. Let's go. Shit way too simple, so we gonna do this for one time, for the one time, so yo man, when he bump this shit, he know exactly why you left his ass at home, you ain't just give it to the last nigga on the first night, so you and your friends think you slick, you really think a nigga ain't got that shit figured out, I ain't here to judge you, but I ain't stand for that run around shit nigga. Just driving to the Americana. <laughs> You guys look so precious. That's a pit bull. No, he looks mixed though, not pit yeah. bull. This one is cute. I know, he, did you see? He came right up to me. Adopt, don't shop. Adopt, don't shop. You <laughs> benefit. On my way to Kate Somerville to get a facial. For the past, like, couple weeks I've been really stressed out really busy we're moving I have all this work to do and I'm so grateful for it but it's taking a toll on my skin and I normally go see my girl Audrina but sometimes you just need to splurge a little bit more and just get pampered you know and I've been to Kate Somerville before and it is absolutely incredible so I think I'm going to show you guys what exactly happens during a facial should be fun
that was so relaxing. Uh, we did the LED treatment. I did that for the very first time ever. And you can see like my mascara is a mess, but um, I can already tell the difference. My skin feels so soft. This was well worth it. I really needed this. Good morning, everyone. So today I'm at Way. We're shooting something very top secret. I'm not su supposed to show you the product yet because it comes out in January. And also, I wanted to show you guys. That's really cool. So she curled my hair and then now she's just running the curling iron through the curled hair to relax it a little bit. That's a fun little trick. Alright guys, we are at location number two. Look number two. Look at this amazing loft. I am so dead right now. Alright guys, one last and final, hopefully, donation stop of our move and it is to Wagmore Wilders where we rescued Luke and Levi because we have a lot of like blankets, bedding, pillows. I actually have a dog pillow or dog bed back there and I'm going to donate them, donate all of them to Wilders because they could use it. Here are um, some of the rescue puppies they have. I don't know what breed this group is. I've actually never seen this group of uh, puppies here before. Oh, they're all sleeping though, they're sleepy. And then here are the adult dogs up for adoption. Um, they're running low. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. And there's some playing underneath there. <gasps> they're running low, that's good. People are adopting, amazing. Um, I will always be an advocate for adoption um, of animals. And as you can see by Luke and Levi, there are really cute puppies that are available at all rescues or adoption places if you're interested in an animal please always look at the shelters and rescues first before you go to um, a breeder i have a lot to say about that but we're going to keep it lighthearted. it's official we're moving out tomorrow and that's totally fine everything's scheduled but i was downstairs talking to everyone that works here And I think I'm gonna like really miss it here. The complex is fine. Like we love the gym, we love the amenities, there's a pool, whatever. Um, but I really like the people who work here, whether they're like in the office or maintenance or janitorial, like they're all really nice and I think that's, that's what I'm gonna miss most. This was my first apartment with Brian. This is where we adopted Luke and Levi. This is their first home. I've never gotten emotional about moving before. Like I've moved four times in the past like three years, but I think this this place is special to me. All right, moving day. I've already locked ourselves out of the apartment for an hour, so uh, things are going swell. There's Brian driving the U-Haul because I definitely could not do that. <laughs> have to come back tomorrow just to finish stuff. We ran out of room. We have a couple bikes that I need to pick up, but yeah. This is it. I'm not crying. You're crying. <laughs> 